Hi, this is John Galvez with Marcon out here in Dome Valley, just east of Yuma, where today we're having our most significant ice event of the season so far. We've had a few light ice events, but temperatures really dipped down after a cold front brought some really cold air into the area. You can see what it looks like here. Uh, heads are just really frozen over, and you can see that uh, it's going to be several hours before the crews have to wait for this to thaw and can get started with today's production. You know, we were just starting to feel it ease up. We know it's been really hard with crazy markets, tight supplies. We've been in a hole since we started here in Yuma, but uh, things were starting to get better. We actually started packing our first uh, uh, Marcom first crop lettuce of the season just yesterday after weights have been improving, right? It's been a very long time since we've been able to meet our weight specs. They just started to improve and here comes the ice. It's gonna slow things down again. We're expecting more ice over the next couple of days that uh, is gonna cause some harvesting, production and loading delays, as well as potentially having an impact on quality. Remember, you know, this stuff's over, it's gonna be harvested. It won't be too affected, but the stuff that's young, the, the crops that are young and growing and have to live through these uh, ice events back to back, those are really gonna to start to show the quality challenges. We've already started to see a little bit of epidermal blister and peel from previous ice events and romaine items. Not too much, not too much yet, not too significant, but we do expect that to get worse over the next couple of weeks because of the ice that we're seeing right now. So that's all for now. I wanted to keep you posted. Hopefully things don't get too rough for us because we're just starting to turn a corner here. Uh, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.